Okay, so now we've, we've established the fact that when the ball moves, we're going to close out. Now the next thing we got to do is we got to guard the ball. We have to really, 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 really guard the ball. Okay? Now, so my favorite drill, and we try to get as many competitive drills as we can. We call it baseball. So give me, just give me like, you know, five guys in, in, in white out here, white jerseys, and then five guys in black jerseys on the O. Okay? Right there. So you guys got the ball, and one basketball out here. So as we, as we build things, we went transition defense to get them stopped. Now we went closeouts. Now, now the next thing, we're going to work on guarding the ball. And we won't, we'll just walk through what this, in fact, is, and we won't even actually have the guys do it. So we, we closed out, so we already know we can close out. Now we got to guard the ball. So you just walk it out there. You don't have to close out this time. We call this baseball, and we do it for three innings. One inning on the wing, one inning at the top, and one inning on this wing. Okay, but it's a competitive drill just guarding the ball. Your guy's job is to get three outs. Your job is to score as much as you can, because that's we're going to keep score. It's a, it's a running tally for three innings. So you have three dribbles on offense. If you get fouled in the act of shooting, it's two or three, whatever the case, if you shot a three. Um, if you get fouled on the floor, we just check it up again. If you get fouled twice on the floor, it's two points. All right? When you guys get three outs, then you get to go on offense. Then when we get three outs, then we go here again. Okay? And we go, let's see, that's one inning, two innings, three innings. We call it baseball. So basically all it is is a competitive drill guarding the ball. And then at the end of it, we make the losers run. I think in this day and age, I don't know, maybe it's different for you guys, but for, for my teams, the more competitive drills – and I'm not smart enough to figure out how to get them to do things unless I make them run, so I always make them run if they lose. Um, <clears throat> you guys may have a different philosophy, that's fine. But, so that's what we would do. So that would be the next thing in terms of how are, how are we building the defense, transition defense, let's close out, now let's guard the ball. Now let's guard the ball, okay? So that's what we would do. We don't, we'll just go through it real quick here. Go ahead. You guys, so you got three dribbles. Go ahead. That's it. Finish it off. Good. One out. Good. Next. So then the next guy would go. That's one out. Here we go. Two outs. Good. Here we go. Shot. Good. Three outs. Good. Switch now. Switch. 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 That's good. These guys are already good defensively. All right, here we go. Good, three, three points. Good, here we go. One out. Here we go, one out. Two outs. Here we go. Five. Black's got five. Two outs. Here we go. Three outs. Okay, so everybody get it. That would be one inning. Then we would switch. You guys would come on offense here, defense. But it's 5-0 it's after one inning. And we would go three innings keeping score the whole way through, losers are going to run.